And the added benefit is that you're a little bit less of a little, little, <laughs> little couch cushion monster hiding the couch all the time, huh? Get out and see in the world. How'd the pet store go? Very good. We didn't come over to the pet store. Right? You gotta look at my snap oh story. Gosh. Are you Snapchat? Yeah. She was dancing. Get it, girl. Get it, girl. Yeah. Dance, dancing in a pet store. We don't even care. Who gonna stop us? Nobody. So we are trying to do as much um, going out into public as possible. They go, we need to go to the pet store. Uh, you know, Isaiah, you go pick up, pick up dog food, take Abby with you. Is this good? Is that good? You seem, in, you seem worried. Hold on, come here, come here, come here. Don't mess with that. Listen, can you push the cart for me? You got the cart, you push it. Come on. Doing good. You know, go to the grocery, take Abby with us. Like trying to do that as much as possible because it's gonna be a big part of school is going out <laughs> into Gen Pop <laughs> and uh, experiencing the world. <laughs> but the purpose is that every time she goes out, she's learning life skills and learning how to deal with the sensory input of the environment around her. And uh, this is something we're gonna be doing a lot more of with homeschooling. Uh, every single opportunity getting her to go out. Uh, motor skills, so many things that she's learning in that environment. Huh? You good, are you good with the orange juice or do you want a snack? Do you want a treat? Okay, come on. Uh, let's go through here. What do you want? Look around a little bit. Let's look around. You don't want just the first <laughs> chips you see. What do you want? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> don't open it yet. Don't open it yet. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Turn around, turn around. Do you want candy? Do you want candy? <laughs> you got one Snickers? Hold on, hold on. It's not. Let's see. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. You can have whatever you want, okay? Don't tell mom and dad. Can't even take it. Are there too many options? This is too much? Hey, come on. Look. There's chips and crackers over here that you can get. Do you want some chips and. Oh, hey, hey, look. Look right here. Look right here. You see this? Head up. You see? Do you want those? Okay, we can get those. Is that it? Are we all done? Yeah? Okay, come on. You got it. Stay right there. Look, put it in there. Put it in there. There you go. In a second, there we go. Yeah, pull it out. Pull the card out. Nice, thank you. Hey, you're so excited. Abby, you're so excited. Oh my gosh, come on. Let's go to the car. Nothing this kid loves more than going to dailies and getting a treat. Look at <laughs> Yeah, baby, we got our stuff. Woohoo! Don't even know how to act. Hey, Abby. <laughs> and we know that a lot of kids really benefit from clinical time uh, for their therapy, but where Abigail's at right now, the uh, being out in the world and experiencing real life in a, what'd you call it, a not controlled? Yeah, just an uncontrolled environment. You know, it's, she doesn't need to have nothing on the table right. and she can only do the work that she needs to do. Well, and it, it gives her more opportunities for, for uh, unknown challenges. Mm -hmm. So then she can learn to face, because she's 17 now, so she yeah. can learn to face those things uh, and, and learn how to take those on. Because a lot of that is, is gonna be stuff that she has to learn on her own, not even something we can, we can teach her. And the reason why this is such a big thing and a big focus right now is because not long ago, if you guys have been following our story, we had so many challenges with going out in public. Uh, the anxiety was so high there that that uh, she really had struggles doing that. But now, thanks to you know proper balance of anxiety medication as well as therapy, uh, with getting her out into those into those places, she's able to do it. So that's why now is the time and why we're working on it with with such fervor. Fervor. But it definitely helps going to places where we can provide um, a distraction or a reward for overcoming those aversions, huh? Like grandma's cookies from Dallas. Some orange juice, am I right? You had cookies. Yeah, cookies, that's right. That's what you had. Cookies and show me drink. Can you show me drink? Drink, that's right. You had those things. And the other bonus? 
is that you had a really fun moment with your sister. Mm -hmm. And you're going to miss her like hell when you go back to college. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Two people tonight were like, is this your sister? I was like, yeah. Yeah, she is. She's a freaking goon. I know. She's in the pet store screaming. No, he's going to miss her. Yeah. Hair rub. Mm -hmm. We don't do that. No. Camera. 